so great. After so much time with our product and our company, do you have any interesting stories with the Looper Plate? Oh gosh, yeah. I, I, you know, I've shot tens of thousands of rounds through guns lubricated with Looper Plate products. I mean, I, I, I uncounted numbers of rounds. Um, the one that sticks out, though, I was taking a rifle course in a, a range in Nevada. And it was the strangest place. You know, Nevada is really sandy. Well, this was not sand. The, the ground around here was like talcum powder. I'm not kidding. It was like talcum powder. Um, it was it was dusty, and it got into things. And like it get into plastic, you couldn't wash this stuff off. It was just nasty. And so we had a whole bunch of guys uh, there and taking this rifle class. And the last day, we had this shoot-off. So you're shooting man against man. And I, I finished my shoot-off. and. I had, of course, lubricated my, I had two AR rifles, AR-15s, that I lubricated with Lubriplate like I always do. And one of the things that I did in preparation for this is I, is I lubricated the bolts and the bolt carrier with SFL grease and then I wiped them fairly clean so there wasn't a lot of excess, right? Because I knew that that would attract this stuff. And at the end of the second day, my rifles I, were the only ones that had not a, uh, had a malfunction. And it got to the point that I had finished my, my shooting and the other guys were coming to me to borrow my rifles because theirs were failing in this nasty, awful talcum powder sand stuff. And it just, it, they're AR-15 rifles. It, there was nothing special about them except for the fact that I was using Luber plate. And, it, it was perfect. It, the guns kept operating, and I converted a lot of people that day to Lubriplate products. As you know, we're introducing our new firearms lubrication products at SHOT Show 23 this year. So what can you share with us about our products? Well, uh, of course, Lubriplate is not new to the gun lubrication world. Uh, Lubriplate, of course, is known to a lot of people for their, uh, their automotive lubricants and their industrial lubricants. And to a lot of GIs who came out of World War II, they were known for this product, which was made specifically to lubricate the operating rod on an M1 rifle. And so a lot of people came back from World War II and knew the Lubriplate product. And this product was made from the early 40s up into the 70s. They were using it on the M14 rifles in Vietnam, so a lot of the Vietnam vets, at least in the early stages, uh, use this product and know it. So now we've got the new product, the, the, the uh, you know, 21st century product for gun lubrication. So we've got the FMO gun oil and then the SFL gun grease, which is kind of the modern equivalent of the old GI grease even better performance than they had back when they won the contract, a competitive contract to get for the M1 rifle uh, because of their superb performance and it's even better today with the fully synthetic uh, greases and the superb oil that we have. We're definitely proud of our history. Thank you so much, Grant. Yeah.